Hi guys, I'm Louise Rowe, fashion expert and author of Front Row, my style guide. It's all about confidence though, as well as just the fashion. And I'm here at my friend's boutique, Ella DK, to show you guys, give you some ideas on how to dress for a first date to make sure you're so irresistible you get a second, a third and a fourth date too. A first date is terrifying enough without worrying and stressing about what you wear. So give yourself the best shot at making an amazing first impression and do the preparation. And that might mean going shopping with a friend or trying on outfits the day before. We all do it. The first date outfit I want to show you guys is actually super low key. It's a daytime look. It's not always about dressing up to the nines. A really well fitted pair of blue skinny jeans is the ultimate. It's the essential. It's the wardrobe staple. You want to go for a slightly light wash and then quite small pockets that sit in the middle of the cheek. If you get too big pockets, they will actually increase the size of your bootay. So the higher the pocket, the more bootylicious you're gonna look. And you wanna turn other heads in the room, right? So he gets a bit jealous. These are just huge at the moment. I've seen all the hottest girls wearing really cute monogram tees or with little sketches like this. It's actually designed by a friend of mine. And then the flat sandal is your best friend for summer. I love these because they've got the cheeky little wings on the back, but something gold will always make your skin look really tanned and beautiful and luscious. I'm all about the accessories. A really cute embellished Panama like this one. Check out the detail on the side. It just pops or these kind of shades. Now the shape, the actual bat wing kind of cat eye shape, not only is that bang on trend right now, but it also has the added illusion of making your eyebrows and eyes kind of lifted so you look a bit sexier, trust me, it works. He will just think you're the coolest thing ever. If you're going to a bar, so more of an evening look, you want to look like you didn't put loads of effort in, but you're just effortlessly sexy, it just happened. That for me means a skinny leather pant. I love this particular pair because of the detail on the stitching. It's got a real biker vibe to it. They are just the ultimate piece. I wear mine all the time. I think a top like this is absolutely perfect. First of all, it's a really touchable fabric, it's suede. And second of all, the spaghetti straps, which are a huge trend at the moment, are very, very sexy. So the thinner the strap, the more seductive you are. Heels for this, I would say go pretty sexy. These have got a bit, let's say 50 shades of grey vibe to them. And I think that boys would find them very hard to resist. The strappiness, the open toeness, it's just all very sexy. If you are going to the serious dinner date and it's a fancy schmancy restaurant, dress up, own it and wear a cocktail dress. This is a beautiful, very dressed up first date dress. Anything strapless is very attractive. The decolletage is just gorgeous. Don't forget to put your little slightly glimmery sheen on to make your skin look like Jessica Alba's, just toffee and gorgeous. If you don't have any shimmer at home, use SPF spray because it has the same effect. I use that on shoots a lot. I love how this has got a gorgeous scalloped lace lining. It looks a little bit like lingerie and that is very suggestive without being overt and I love it. The ultimate shoe for this would be a metallic stiletto heel. I think the combination of this is gorgeous. With a dress that sexy and shoes that fabulous, you want to keep the jewelry quite subtle and delicate. Little thin bangles, the way I've got mine like stacked up here. And that's it, less is more. And have fun and you want to be comfortable. If you're all corseted up in something too tight or you can't eat in it, you won't be the sexiest fun version of you. Good luck, hope you kiss. For more videos like these, check out Mode.